Can you make a bit of noise if you're ready to get the stage started, please? Whoa. You're ready. You're ready. My name is Bob Heaney, and I am the one of the members of the York Region Tammy Coalition. And it's my absolute honor to have all of you sitting in this room today, both on this level and the balcony level. I've never spoken to a balcony before. How are you doing up there? All right, we've got a balcony today. This is excellent, excellent. Uh, before we get going with all the housekeeping and all the other stuff, I would like to bring on uh, Patricia Preston from the Earth Catholic District School Board to say a few remarks. Patricia? Thanks very much. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. How are you doing today? Good. All right. I am very pleased to welcome you this morning. This is a special conference. We are now in the fourth year of the Stomping Out Stigma Summit, and I am so pleased to bring greetings on behalf of the York Catholic District School Board. I know that many of the students here today have attended previous Stomping Out Stigma Summits, and I thank you for becoming student ambassadors within our York Region and York Catholic Schools. Your dedication and your work have been critical in introducing some wonderful initiatives for your fellow students. Today will be a day of sharing, learning, and raising awareness about mental health and addiction issues that have touched so many lives. We will hear and we will meet several people who have experienced mental health issues and stigma firsthand. Their personal experiences will be incredibly valuable in helping all of us to learn why stigmas exist and what we can do to break them down. I know that you are also looking forward to the smaller breakout sessions where you can ask questions, brainstorm as a group, and come up with ways to positively impact your own school communities. At the conclusion of today's session, each school will be given a toolkit, and it will contain ideas to get the word out and to make changes in attitudes and actions. This toolkit includes ideas such as establishing lists of books that address mental illness, holding poster contests to depict current statements and what can be done to reduce them, as well as many other ideas and strategies. These activities will engage students in discussions that will lead to a better understanding, awareness, and acceptance. It is clear that a tremendous amount of work has gone into organizing today's event. And I would like to thank and recognize Bob Heaney, who greeted you first thing this morning, who has been instrumental in bringing mental health addiction awareness into York Region. And thank you as well to all of the committee members who worked so hard with Bob. Let's give them all a big hand this morning. I would like to close with a quote from poet John O'Donoghue. One of the most beautiful gifts in the world is the gift of encouragement. When someone encourages you, that person helps you over a threshold you might otherwise never have crossed on your own. And I hope you will keep this message in mind as you hear the speakers this morning. I wish all of you a great day. Thank you.